So just a little bit about Temple, Texas. Uh, we do have a very long history. We began around 1880. Um, so there was a railroad that basically crossed through this area. Um, and the, this railroad purchased about 187 acres for a construction camp. Um, soon after that, they then built a hospital, which was Scott and White. And that was in 1897. And then they hired the very first radiologist in 1912. So we like to say that our radiology department began at that time. And then we first started having residents in 1945. And so you'll hear Scott and White a lot. These are the two doctors that started uh, the initial hospital. And so you'll hear that reference quite a bit. All right, so just a little bit more about our history. So um, we like to talk a lot about Claudia Potter. Um, so she was hired in 1906, and she was the first female doctor hired at Scott and & White. And she was also the very first female anesthesiologist in the United States. And so this just demonstrates our culture of inclusivity. And you can see that throughout our residency, um, we are very inclusive as far as um, gender, race, ethnicity, things like that. Um, so our current name is Baylor Scott and & White. And so we merged with the Baylor Health System in Dallas in 2013. And as a conglomerate healthcare system, we uh, comprise of a $9 billion healthcare system. And this is the number one Texas nonprofit hospital and the number two Texas hospital overall. And they were number 10 in the United States. And so we're a very large healthcare system, and this really helps for. Um, just um, our influence in the area and also attracting some of the, um, you know, some of the best residents, uh, faculty, and things like that. And so we also have a long history in that regard, too. And so just to get an idea of the areas that we cover, and this is something that's really important to us and really um, signifies us as a residency is our case volume. So our case volume is determined by the patient population that we serve. And although Temple, Texas is a smaller city, about 100,000 people within the general area, we serve a patient population of about 2 million people. And so you can see this area in Central Texas. Um, to the north is Dallas, which is more uh, population dense. And then uh, the blue you can see there is Central Texas. And then we have people on our healthcare plan all around that area as well. And so this allows for our residents to see a very large case volume, the size of a large city. However, we are primarily the only hospital serving this large patient population. And so Baylor Scott and White Memorial refers to the hospital here that we conduct our residency, which is in Temple, Texas. Uh, this hospital is a multi-specialty facility. We have 46 residencies and fellowship programs. And so when you have all these different uh, educational programs, this leads to a diverse pathology and you're rarely referring cases out. So, you know, for instance, if you have plastic surgery, if you have, uh, you know, transplant surgery, um, you'll begin to see all those cases and follow up and be getting experience with uh, those imaging studies. Um, we are a employee based setting. Uh, so this is what we call a clinic club model, which is similar to the Cleveland Clinic, Mayo Clinic and Oshner Clinic, if you're familiar with those. Um, and then Dr. Montgomery is our department chair and he serves on the board of directors uh, for the hospital. So this is really great for having representation of radiology and our residency uh, throughout the hospital. And then when you have that represent representation, our faculty, I like to say happy staff equals happy residents. So we're all happy here. <laughs>